Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. This is the Stepford map. Now we're sitting over here at San Angeles. And what I'm thinking of doing here is uh, connecting up this uh, food processing plant, right? Uh, so now uh, the question is, where are the farms? And that is a good question. Well, we need, I think we need four farms to connect. So where are they? Well, let's uh, put a pin in there so we can find it again. And then we'll go in uh, the industry list. And we'll go by product. Um, okay, so we're looking for farms with nothing being shipped. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven of them. Okay, so that means we've got, uh, okay. So Cityville. Uh, so where is this one? That's over here. Wait a minute. Um, oh, right. Okay. Cityville is, uh, that one's plumbed in, but not running. Uh, that one's plumbed in. Uh, but, and that one's plumbed in. Okay. So we need to look at uh, New New York. That one is not plumbed in. Okay. And New New York 2 is not plumbed in. Okay. And Riverdale Farm is plumbed into something. Okay. Well. Okay, now let's go back up here. Um, okay. Well, we've got a couple of uh, farms here that we can uh, plumb in. The new New York ones, right? Oh, I closed the blasted um, thing. Okay. Uh, okay, so we need to get from here up to New New York, right? Okay. So we got one there and one there, and we need to get down to here. How do we do that? Well, I'm half thinking we want to come up this line since it already has a connection over to here, I think. So, yeah, I think that's what we do. So that means I need to get uh, a station in for New New York Farm, and then another station in for New New York Farm 2. And, yeah. I think that, uh, yep, yeah, definitely. Uh, that's what we need to do. Okay. We have a plan of attack. So we're going to grab a uh, rail station, a cargo station, no less. And we're going to wang it around like this. And if we do this, we can get it in parallelish to that road. Uh, kind of like that. Yeah, so we'll call this the New New York Farm. Right? Good. And then, uh, we need another one over here. Okay, now this needs to come... Uh, okay. We kind of want to come off about here. No, probably. Oh, how are we going to do this? Um, okay, I need to get I need to get a track over from the uh, from here. Okay, so we can come through. We can get under here. 
but we can't really oh yeah we can get yeah we got the road in the way though um yeah so i think we're gonna have to go we're gonna have to go over okay or under over might be easier uh okay let's try that uh so we'll grab a uh, track no catenary catenary whatever uh, if we come out of here and we do this, um, under might work better here, actually. So if we do this, uh, to here, yeah, like this. Then we can come around. Um, uh, okay. What are we going to do? Well, we're going to get our... Uh, no, here... Okay, we're going to do it to here. Okay, now I'm going to chuck in another station right here. I think you can probably guess what I'm probably going to do here. Uh, yeah, that's not quite what I want to do. Okay, so I want to have a track come in like this. And then we'll do this, right? Okay. Now, uh, I need to get from here onto the main line there because that will come up and around this way, I think, if I remember correctly. So, uh, I need to uh, somehow arrange that. Uh, and I don't think I can do it from here. Uh, if I do this, can I get up or down? Well, not down. Um, no, I can't. I'm going to have to do a crossover if I do it from there. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll do it that way. Uh, okay. So if we do this and this, right, then we should be able to not make that work. Hmm. No, you idiot. You clicked the wrong thing. I can close that. Uh, okay, we need to pull a sharp connection on here. Okay. Well, we need to come... I don't know, let's, uh, oh wow. Okay, well, we'll come off of here. And we're going to need to come down bubble on this. I think... Now, will that connect? Well, it does. I think I'm going to have to do it this way. Yeah. This is not ideal, but... I think it'll work, at least. Uh, where's the... Okay. If we do this, and we do this... Aha! Okay, we can at least put a cross over there. Good. Uh, right. Well, uh, I guess we'll put a signal there and a signal there and remove that one. Yep. And then we're going to need a signal here and we're going to need a 
two-way one here. Yep, that's right. I'm going to run just the one track over there. Uh, right. Now, where do we have a uh, depot that we can fling a train at that from? We don't, do we? No, no, we don't. Okay, well, let's... Uh, well, let's... Um, uh, get these two windows over here so that we can find them easy later. And we'll go over here. Now, uh, whoops. We need to get that onto the main line connection, right? Uh, and that means it's going to have to come in over here somehow. Hmm. You know what? I don't know how I'm going to do that. Uh, well, I could possibly come in on this tunnel here. Let's, uh, yeah, I think I could come in on that tunnel. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Okay, uh, we're going to grab a station, uh, which we're going to... We're going to put two platforms on it, and we're going to stick it here. And this is the San Angeles Food Processing Plant, right? Uh, so, Food Processing Plant. Yeah. Okay, good. Uh, now, uh, I need what you would call tracks, right? So, we come up like this, and... Okay, can we... I think we can. Okay, so we do this. Yep. We do this. Go just a little bit further and a little bit further. Yep. Then we can do this. Too much curvature, really? Ah, there we go. That one works. And then we can do the same. Come on, find the snap point. There we go. There we go. We got a uh, connection point. Okay. Now we can come out of here. And where is it? There it is. Bang it on there. Yeah! Okay, that works. Okay. Theoretically, that gives us a connection point. So, now we need a signal on here. Yep. And we'll stick a couple over here. Oh, yes. And we need uh, a crossover here. Uh, so we'll just shove one of those in, right? Uh, yep, that's a crossover, and we need one of these. Okay, now what we need to do is fling a uh, one of these into here, and then we can fling a track on like this. Yes, that has definitely got our... Uh, our stuff uh, going there. Okay. Right. Uh, we need to now buy a couple trains. Uh, we'll go with diesel. And we'll go with our trusty SD40. And we'll go cargo, right? And we'll go with our trusty gondola. Yeah, that's, yeah we'll, we'll stick that many on there. Now, we're going to buy two of these. Yep. Uh, good. Now, we'll just uh, park that. Uh, now, uh, this one, we will add a new line, which will go from here 
to here. It connects. Okay. So this is Cargo Rail, New New York Farm 2 to San Angeles. Uh, food. Okay. What we are probably going to do is ride one of these trains as well. Um, yeah, I think that's what we'll do for the, uh, the l latter part of this. Um, I need to uh, fix the uh, naming here. Farm number two. Yeah, okay. Um, right, we can close that. Good. Now we can uh, go back in here and we can do a new line going here and here yeah okay so that's cargo rail new new york farm to san angeles uh food right okay uh good uh we can get rid of that we can get rid of this now what we want to do also is make a food delivery into San Angeles right so uh, I'm just going to grab a uh, truck drop-off point and where's the food being dropped off here uh, all around over here well if I put the uh, drop off here, yeah, I think that, that'll get most of it. And then if we go over here and we put a uh, single platform uh, truck thingy here, uh, I don't know, like, uh, like, no. Uh, we got a, okay, that gets us a, okay, so this is the San Angeles, uh, food processing plant. Yep. Okay, now we need a, uh, road. Say that one, uh, which can come out like this. And we'll do this. And we'll do this. Yeah, that should work. Good, right. Uh, we need also a building, uh, so we can fling trucks at this. Uh, can we, we fit this in here? No. We can fit it over here, though. Yeah, we can. Okay. So, we're going to buy a, uh, our trusty, um, tarpaulin truck down here. Uh, this guy, right? Uh, we're going to put four of them. And we're going to go a new line. We're going to pick up over here. We're going to drop off over here. Yep. Good. So this is cargo truck. San Angeles food to San Angeles. Okay. Good. Yes. That's got that. Now, uh, we have the, uh, the basics of this thing plumbed in. And it should basically work. Good. Uh, so now the thing to do is, uh, you know, that's um, almost 20 minutes, right? So uh, I guess now what we can do is we can jump on here and we can ride the train. Now, I can't remember. I didn't look where we were in the, in the line here. Um, but we're heading to the farm, right? So, uh, yeah, so there's that. And now we just need to, uh, oh, yeah, we're, oh, we got a train going the other way. Oh, look, it's a train. Uh, yeah, of course, it's on the tracks. Of course, it's a train, isn't it? Right. So, we're in a tunnel. Aren't tunnels exciting? I do kind of wonder if it would be, uh, you know, beneficial to the game if they uh, had some way of texturing the tunnels, but, eh. Anyway, uh, where are we here? We're, uh, we're coming out of the tunnel. Yay! And, uh, 
Yeah, right. This is a this is a long line. Uh, probably what I should do uh, off screen is uh, plumb in those farms with trains for the ones that aren't um, actually um, what you call it uh, transporting anything yet. Because uh, I think we basically got things. Uh, to the uh, point where there's not much left to do, is there? That's a pretty uh, ferocious bridge viaduct thing there, isn't it? Um, yeah, that is pretty ferocious. Uh, right, yeah. Uh, definitely ferocious. Um, Right, what is it? Huh. Ferocious is what it is. Okay, we're uh, swapping lines here. Ah, oh, yes, we're switching to our connection, connecting line. Yeah, that will uh, definitely uh, uh, make a... Uh, a difference here and, you know because it'll get us to our de destination right uh, if we wouldn't switch the right line we wouldn't yeah I know uh, riveting commentary isn't it uh, right well that's a uh, bizarre looking bridge coming from that angle um, been a while since we rode this line hasn't it uh, right So I want to see how well that uh, connection point at the uh, other uh, farm there, at, you know, at the first farm on the line works. Uh, it'll work. It'll do its thing, of course. But, uh, you know, at least the routing thing thinks it'll work. We are ticking along at 90-odd uh, K, so, uh, you know, it's not like the train's running slow. That's good. That's the nice part about later on in the uh, the game when you've got uh, faster uh, uh, transport options, right? Uh, you've got more um, you, you got more uh, oomph, and it means that the uh, uh, the trains can just move, right? On the other hand, it makes uh, shorter lines less practical because the operating costs kill you, right? Uh, you know, I I really want to get the next uh, the next map I do. I think I want to have less mountains. Yeah, I think that would be good. Uh, more uh, more surface lines, I think, would be better. So I think uh, I think I'm going to go for something with a little bit less trees and uh, larger spaces between towns. I think. Uh, so maybe I'll go with a uh, maybe I'll go with a uh, long skinny map uh, with uh, you know a few metro areas and uh, uh, you know maybe maybe I'll start with an empty map. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm still pondering, right? But uh, I'm pondering doing something similar to what the colonel's been doing with his uh, peninsula uh, uh, redo thing where he's uh, you know just building everything from scratch right uh, you, you know doing kind of like a high detailing constructing everything including the towns like basically building a model uh, model railroad right uh, but I'm not sure I really want to get into the uh, detailing aspect of things is that's uh, well one uh, I'm colorblind, so uh, that makes uh, some of the detailing a little bit annoying. And two, I don't think I could deal with putting all that fiddly effort into it, right? Uh, but what I'm I'm pondering is, uh, uh, you know, a uh, a a game where or, or a uh, a map where, uh, yeah, I'll, I set up the main towns uh, and a few suburbs in five or six uh, major uh, 
locations, five or six major locations, three to five uh, uh, towns in the in each individual major location, and then a whack load of industry uh, that uh, can be connected up. Ooh, that's uh, that's that's the sort of thing that uh, you know uh, the detailing types would uh, fix, right? Yeah, this is a really sharp set of corners, but uh, yeah, we did it for a reason, right? Anyway, uh, the, the idea is that, you know, like a whack load of industry and uh, uh, set up such that we can possibly uh, uh, run a, uh, a, a what, what do you call it, a... Uh, Uh, sort of a uh, freight, uh, a more a more focused freight uh, distribution network. Uh, that that's kind of what I'm uh, I'm looking at, right? Uh, you know, kind of like a main line, but not exactly. You know, where uh, you know there'll be uh, hubs for the different types of uh, you know hub points for different types of uh, of freight and. Uh, you know, construction hubs, you know, industry areas, that sort of thing, right? Uh, so that's kind of what I'm, I'm looking at. And I haven't, uh, I haven't worked out exactly what I'm going to do yet. But I think that's going to be a, uh, a major um, consideration, right? Um, maybe I'll start with, uh, with having uh, placed the primary industries and... Uh, a few no no I don't think I'll do that I think I'll place all the industries ahead of time but uh, yeah I'm gonna have to do some map uh, map building uh, before uh, before I start right uh, so I'm looking for a map about the size of the dune canyon map uh, that the colonel did uh, but I'm not going to do it like the dune canyon uh, that one was uh, pretty frightening uh, right uh, so that kind of size, uh, with long uh, long hauls between uh, between major center centers, maybe a few smaller uh, outliers, right? And then the idea is that we run uh, passenger services between them, and also run freight and get the uh, the freight operations uh, going, right? And I'm kind of pondering starting that map in 1850. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of pondering that. Uh, let's see if we can uh, take that and uh, keep it profitable enough to uh, survive to a decent uh, time point. Yeah, uh, that's uh, something I'm, uh, I'm considering at least. Okay, so this bit works. Okay. Uh, so I have to say that uh, this worked out uh, well enough, so let's uh, let's jump out of here. Uh, let's uh, go over here and fix that signal. Uh, right. Okay. So we want a signal, and we're going to put it here, and we're going to take for that one out. Yeah. Okay. That's that's definitely better. Okay. That has that has worked. Um, yeah, uh, now I, I, uh, I'm kind of having the, the idea I have for a, another series, uh, just based on how the, uh, the major, uh, cross map main line here from over here all the way down to here has been working and it's worked out quite well. So... Uh, I just want to have a slightly less challenging build, like a little bit less of this. Well, that was kind of nice. Uh, a little bit less of it would be good. Not none of it, but a little bit less. Maybe, uh... So, so what I'm thinking of is have a couple of uh, urban areas like this, multiple towns, that all, will ultimately agglomerate. Uh... And maybe a few smaller ones, like maybe Winchester and Fieldville size here. And, uh, and the idea is each uh, agglomeration 
will have uh, all three cargos demanded somewhere in the uh, in the various uh, uh, parts of the uh, agglomeration, like all three commercial, all three industrial. So that's the idea. Uh, so I just need to uh, make a map uh, because I want to avoid this kind of density here because you look at the lay of the land here. Everything from here all the way up to here is really one urban agglomeration, uh, you know, based on the uh, how it's uh, developed, right? Now, actually looking in here, uh, yeah, we got some pretty horrid traffic here, so... Yeah, I don't know. I I uh, gave up trying to fix the traffic here. The tools just aren't available, right? Uh, but I think we can keep the traffic manageable if the density is a little bit less on the map. That's that's the idea. Uh, and I want to have some more long haul uh, rural uh, rail lines, right? Uh, so that's the idea. Uh, so if you have some ideas on uh, maybe a starting point map in the workshop or something like that, I'm interested. Uh, I may uh, I may take you up on whatever idea you uh, you fling my way, or I might not. We'll see. But if you have any ideas on that, uh, you know, leave a comment or something. But otherwise, um, I'm gonna call it here. Uh, there's gonna be uh, at least one more episode here, probably two. Uh, this map is getting pretty busy, so I'm not sure. I, I might do some passenger work, actually, uh, for a couple episodes. Uh, maybe fling in uh, some a couple airports or something like that. Yeah, yeah, that might be what I do. Uh, I haven't done air, so... Yeah, I think, think if I fling in a couple airports, if I can fling in an airport over here... Yeah. Yeah, so next time, uh, if, assuming I remember, uh, we're going to be playing with air travel and passengers. So like, there, there's a little bit of fiddling around we can do with passenger work. And uh, I think uh, I think if we uh, do some passenger work down over here, uh, we can we can get uh, we can get an airport or so in in around here. And on the other corner, and we get we can get a whacking great uh, flight going through there. Yeah, I think that might be the thing to do. Okay, so we have a I have a plan of attack for a few more episodes here. So I got a little bit of time before I before I need to come up with a new map. Um, yeah, and hopefully they'll have a game update sometime in the next little while, which improves performance. Anyway, that's uh, that's all for this time. So stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much, and see you back next time.